Now a look at a story you'll see later tonight, a hero's homecoming. A Rhode Island Army captain made the ultimate sacrifice to rescue fellow soldiers in World War II, and now, more than 70 years later, he's finally returning home. Walt Buteau is here with a preview of an amazing story that you'll see only on Eyewitness News. Captain Elwood Joseph Ewart was one of more than 5,000 troops aboard a transport ship in the South Pacific in World War II. In October of 1942, the ship hit a pair of underwater mines. Captain Ewart from Pawtucket actually made it safely to shore and out of harm's way, but then he heard some of his fellow soldiers were still trapped in the sinking ship. He gave his life to, to save his uh, you know, fellow comrades. He was a captain and that was his job, to go down, to, to do whatever he had to do for his troops. And that's just the way, you know, it's the kind of guy he was. Tonight, we take you back 74 years to Captain Ewart's heroic deeds that day. We'll also tell you how his remains were found and what his family and the Army did to bring him home from halfway around the world. Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News. Don't miss this incredible story of bravery and closure decades in the making. A Hero's Homecoming airs tonight on Eyewitness News, starting live at 5.